Off the coast of Taiwan, 35 kilometers out, lies one of the largest offshore wind projects in Asia, Greater Changhua. When complete, it'll power around 2 million homes. But what stood out at Greater Changhua 2BN4 was how the foundations were put in place. Two fields, 66 foundations, one offshore substation, all installed by a single vessel, A-Gear. Offshore wind turbine foundations come in many shapes and sizes. XL monopiles, piled jackets, even floating foundations. The type depends on several factors, like soil conditions. At Greater Changhua, Erste chose suction bucket jackets. These jacket foundations are taller than standard designs. Their weight, height and footprint pushed beyond the limits of many installation vessels available in the region. So Hirama had to stretch Aegir's capabilities beyond what it was originally built to do. They commissioned Hausmann to completely overhaul its second main hoist. The fixed jib section? Removed. Replaced with a much heavier one, capable of handling the increased loads. The upgrade took lifting capacity from 2,000 to 3,200 metric tons, at a height of 110 metres, which is comparable to a 30-storey building. It is Aegir's crew who brought this new power to life. These are the jackets that will anchor Greater Changhua's turbines to the seabed. Each foundation weighs up to 2,400 metric tons and stands up to 85 meters tall. The key lies in the hollow skirts at the bottom, suction buckets. Thanks to favorable soil conditions, they were the perfect fit. Water is pumped from inside the suction buckets, lowering the pressure inside each bucket. Outside pressure stays constant, creating a force that pushes the foundation down from above, while the lower pressure pulls from below. It's a quieter method. And when the time comes, they can be removed more easily at the end of their life cycle. With 66 jackets to install, focus, dedication and teamwork matter. The cycle needs to be repeated flawlessly from start to end. Before each lift, the crew attaches suction pumps to every bucket, with umbilicals running down to a gear. To lift it, they attach a lifting tool on top. Moving something this size takes serious equipment. The upgraded crane was built for this. Bigger lifts handled precisely. After the jacket is lifted and sailed to location, it is placed in pre-installed scour protection donuts, resulting in tight position and heading tolerances before suction begins. Pumps remove the water. Pressure does the rest. Securing the jacket without a single blow. Slowly but steadily, the seabed takes hold. Millimeter by millimeter until the jacket is locked in. Once the survey equipment confirm depth and tilt, the suction operation stops. The pumps are disconnected and prepped for the next jacket, already waiting on standby. Greater Changhua pushed the boundaries of what Aegir and its crew could do. It showed how continuous adaptation is key to powering the world more efficiently. The horizon keeps moving. So do the tools we use to reach it. Behind every successful project are the people who make it happen. Together with Orsted, our onshore and offshore teams brought dedication, precision and resilience every step of the way. <laughs>